Welcome soccer rockets out there. Salam alaikum. Welcome to the new video of Soccer Rocco. My name is Yusuf and today I want to talk about the AFCON 2019 that I got to witness with my dad. I surprised my dad with it. Um, he's 70 years old so you wonder if he's like fit enough for the show but he was he was totally ready for the AFCON. So we went there and got to witness Algeria's quarterfinals and semifinals. It was totally crazy. I danced with the South African fans, uh, sang along with the Senegal fans, and of course Algeria and the brilliant Riyad Mahrez goal free kick that you all watched. Um, at the beginning of the video, I want to talk about the good stuff, the bad stuff. It's going to be brutally honest. I'm not going to tell you all the good, only the good stuff. There's also going to be a lot of bad stuff. And stick around right to the end. Subscribe, like, dislike, do whatever you like. Um, comment if there's anything missing or if you witnessed um, maybe the same problems or good stuff also. First of all, let's start with... Uh, how we got the tickets. Uh, thank you very much to Toscardi, the young, talented, friendly people who gave us the tickets right away because don't forget, this is still Africa. We're talking about Egypt and it, it's a 30 million people city and it's totally crowded. Um, you don't know if you get the tickets right away, so we were cu curious but also patient and um, we talked to, to people who waited like four, five, six, seven, eight hours till they got their tickets. I knew once you get the chance to get the tickets, you should get all the tickets right away. This is my tip for all games in Africa. If you want to buy a ticket or anything, you want to book anything, do it right away. Don't wait till next week or one hour before the, the game starts. Do it early enough. And do it right away so I booked all the tickets all the games we wanted to watch it was Nigeria against South Africa Algeria against Ivory Coast we watched Senegal and Tunisia and after that the legendary historic game of Algeria against Nigeria so if you worked at Tescardi and you watched this video thank you you did a great job you helped us out a lot so I'm uh, grateful number two talking about go into the games. Well, uh, you saw a lot of army, uh, a lot of police going out there, looking at you, staring at you, looking at your jersey, what kind of country you, you're wearing, what kind of team, what, what kind of side you, you're supporting. So, um, but everything was peaceful. Uh, everybody was having a great time. We were celebrating and um, just, you gotta be patient. Don't be scared. It's Africa, it's an Arabic country, it's AFCON. So um, if you ever visit an AFCON one day, just don't be scared. Just walk right past them. Everything is fine. Everything was peaceful. Nothing happened at all. Number three, we also went to the pyramids and to touristic places. You should be very careful, but don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious and don't act like you don't trust nobody. Okay, just be friendly, look at the prices, don't think about Euro all the time or US dollars all the time. Just have a good time and let, them pe let the people live. You want to let the people live because everything is very cheap there. Actually, the Egyptian people were nice, so thank you for that. Uh, very welcoming and um, very friendly and very fair because um, it's not a lot of people who try to rip us off. Uh, even though we, we uh, know how to speak Arabic and understand the culture a little bit, they always know that you're a tourist right away. Even though we're from Morocco, it's the first time we went to Egypt, so it's, it's, it doesn't matter if you're German or American or Scottish or Irish, they don't give a damn. You should go to Africa Cup. Two years is going to be in Cameroon, so um, I think I'm going to be there too. 